Hello guys. Well, I have actually been doing a lot of intros like this for a while, but uh, here we go. We're on the Austin John Plays Realm. Now you can join this realm for free. Nothing you need to do but uh, visit the Discord, visit Austin John on Facebook, and when he streams just ask for him for the Discord and you, you get invited in. Uh, there's like a section in the text that will get you get you on and basically that's that's what happens and this uh, this realm is for everyone which means <laughs> noobs right so there's a lot of noobs on the server people who are new to minecraft um, a lot of people who just want to play with Austin John because he has uh, an audience a wide array of audience who just want to play so yeah, we're starting off here for something I built a long time ago uh, because this portal was actually linking to my portal over here and uh, I moved it. I created um, a little spawn, former spawn island portal thing. This is all my design. It's pretty, it's actually pretty bad in my opinion because uh, in other texture packs this would look, this would look not as good. So we're moving down here. This is my base, right? And also further along there is uh, my ice biome that I found. Oh, I, so, I also forgot to make a portal to the ice biome. Uh, to back the ice biome, but I won't be doing much here. Like the last projects I have to do is finishing the slime farm and uh, and uh, more. <laughs> I don't know what else to do. Uh, so here we go. This is my thing. I've had problems with people uh, killing my cows and um not uh not waiting for me to do some stuff because there's a lot of people who uh just don't <laughs> just don't follow uh the rules of no griefing right so yeah this is my base right let's look on it uh from the side this was a guardian farm uh i had a few streams that did this uh that i that i was uh building around here and i destroyed the whole guardian farm I mean the whole uh, ocean monument uh, with iron tools and iron armor, no deaths. So that actually took like a, a good solid like four days. Uh, good thing I had summer, right? So we do here, uh, this was supposed to be temporary, right? Uh, I'll, these would be where I put the turtle eggs because turtle eggs can only hatch on sand. And this is like a portion to the middle. This is this is basically the only thing that's left out of what was here before. Uh, what I was using as a platform for all my items and stuff. So go down here. There's a little pad that digs around here. You know, look at all this glass, right? This took so much glass. I decimated tons of islands because I couldn't find a desert uh, for all the, um, the sand I needed. So I just running around decimating islands and this is the water system that uh, allows the guardians to spawn really not that much redstone uh, yeah and I duplicated the same thing on the other side and I also have a lot of trees around here which I feel like I should replace um, or place them down below but we'll get to down below in a couple seconds while I while I view this place. This is where I enchant. I don't use it anymore since I have a lot of books from AFK Fishing. And did I, did I even use this side? No, it's useless. And all my dogs are here somehow. I don't know how they got moved over here. Uh, yeah, that's weird. I was thinking water fell down, but water would have also fell down here and broke all my levers, right? So this is my set setup. Um, the levers stop the stop the hoppers from taking items, so I can just give grab an item and get all the XP from it. I uh, have lots of uh, lots of fuel back here, lots of coal because I don't really want to use it as a building item since this whole area is based on water. And we've got a few portals. The portals are actually down, um, <laughs> like right below each other. So. There's no discrepancies there. This was a snow golem. Somehow it died. 
I bet someone just came up and killed it. Uh, um, and I don't know how it somehow died. Like, it is below a block. It won't die to rain. It won't die to the sun or anything like that. This is not even a. This is not even a warm ocean, right? No, it is a deep lukewarm ocean, but it still can. It still can do the. It can still survive here. So, it somehow died. Um, it may have actually glitched through the blocks and walked around. Uh, and since there are a few places where rain can get through, it can get killed like that. And we got a little aquarium here. <laughs> uh, as John said, it was <laughs> it was a little gift display of <laughs> just random fish. And if you go in here, you really can't get out. So, and there's a lot of designs I haven't finished around here. Maybe we'll get to that. Um, yeah, so we have rings around this uh, garden farm as well. This is the Nembom Garden Farm. Which is weird because Nembom Garden Farm is based on a fun on a video on fun designs of garden farms and you have to download the worlds to get all the all the good information. But there's not a really good way to spectate around it, so yeah. So for the ice plant pads I'm using blue ice and this is a zombie spawner. Uh let's just jump right into it. Um, so this is a zombie spawner. It's got basic redstone that controls the controls the redstone lamp inside, as you see a redstone lamp. Um, so yeah, it uh, it's just a whole box of prismarine, and uh, they just travel up this water stream. So yeah, there's like a there's a bunch of turtle eggs and uh, two redstone hatches that are open. So that they think that they can walk past it, but they can't. Uh, and then this is the killing area, and this is actually pretty crowded because I, I'm making, I'm finishing up the slime farms over here as well. So, right now, you just sit around here, and you, uh, you kill. And that's basically it. I don't know why there's the fish went in there, but uh, yeah. So that's Nembom's design. It kind of intrudes on the slime farm, which is not going to be a problem because uh, most of it is going to get fitted with uh, glass, anyways. And I have to put in the I have to put in the iron golems as well, so that they fall down this way, where this is the only pathway I'm going to kill them. And this is the AFK fish farm that I moved. I haven't actually used it a lot. Probably like a few hours at most, but definitely like a day or most of where I used to put it, which is like over around here. Um, yeah, it was like over around here ish where the AFK fish farm used to be, and I put tons of hours into that. Um, why is there no uh, torch? Whatever. So this is where I put all the stuff that I that I currently have. This is a little sorting system for everything. Everything will be moved eventually. But right now it's in it's in an okay spot. So everything is basically made out of glass where it needs to be. And it was such a pain to make uh, all the prismarine for this, but at least it was only four by four for the crafting recipe. I didn't have to get that much. And this is what the slime farm would look like. Uh, I haven't made the crafting area, the killing area, but uh, I think it will be fine, right? And this goes up to level 39, which means it actually can have another platform, but I don't want to intrude on the, on the, like, the, the glass flo floors of everything. And I think it looks cool like that. So, yeah, that's a lot of, that's a lot of stuff to do. And all these are just spaced out four apart. They're just for, um, they're just for mining. And I don't think I'll ever go mining again, seeing that activity on the server is dying down. On the realm is dying down. And this is for the zombie spawner. I'm not sure why I don't keep it on all the time either. Uh, I just don't know. I really like this vegan even though uh, it was given to me by Austin. Whether or not it was, uh, it, was a <laughs> it was a good gift is up to it because I actually finished this whole place with haste too. And it would have taken a lot of more time. And as you can see there's a bedrock layer. Uh, Covered all of Prismarine and some things, and I recently caught a villager that I'm using 
I'm using for this. And I also see the problem that I'm I'm gonna have to half slap this whole area down here in order to prevent slimes from spawning down there. Uh, but yeah, slimes can't actually spawn on bedrock, but they could spawn on the castle between the bedrock. So I could have actually made this all into glass and uh, separated everything into bedrock, but that would have taken a lot more work than necessary, even though this whole thing is basically a lot of work. I just didn't want to go that extra step, and it looks pretty cool, right? I mean, it's all, it's all like eerie, like a huge, huge build, and that makes me happy. So, there are a lot of things I'm going to have to finish, and a lot of things that, uh, that I'm going to have to uh, gather as well, because I'm running out of, I'm running out of glass, and this is definitely not enough to cover this whole area. I haven't used any glass panes, except for, uh, except for in there because that's what the farm designs because glass panes are hard to like build with uh, since it, it, it looks kind of off when it connects to everything else so yeah that's that's basically the reason why and I moved this ladder the ladder was like basically over there so so the things that I have to finish is like a slime farm maybe make a mob farm maybe make a iron golem farm and that's probably it for for this for what I would do in this realm and it's pretty amazing right it's amazing what you can get, get done in like two weeks so yeah see you guys next time I keep doing this <laughs> I don't know why the the lighter wings look a little bit off but it looks so funny okay I was trying to make it a corner there so I guess that's the best I can do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A bit, no, a bit like this. Okay, okay. So, see you guys next time on whatever the next thing is going to be. Uh, and yeah, have a good day. Bye-bye.